Hi there, I'm meteorologist Chicago Wendler, and thanks for checking out tonight's edition of Chicks Chats. What we're talking about is lots of changes in your forecast. We we're in the 40s for today. Tomorrow we could hit 70 despite seeing some morning rain and clouds. After that, another cold front coming through, temps bottom out. We might even flirt with a little bit of ice slash wintry mix by Thursday and again Friday mornings. A lot to talk about. All right, so we're gonna start with the rain. In the morning, 44 degrees at eight o'clock, we could see up to a 10th of an inch of rain. But by midday, those clouds are starting to break, those temperatures starting to warm, we could be up to around 58 degrees. And watch where we're headed this afternoon for Tuesday afternoon, four o'clock, 70 degrees, sunny, breezy, and warm. Here's a look at our future track computer model, just to give you an idea, clouds, fog, patchy drizzle through the overnight hours, morning rush, probably going to be damp and dreary with some spots showers around not heavy rain but just enough to make the pavement wet get your windshield wipers going on intermittent and make for maybe a slower than normal go on the area roads but there's that clearing line first into the hill country sunshine developing last out toward the plains so Lagrange you could still see some rain showers about 10 11 o'clock that's when we'll finally start to see things clear for you and temperatures will be off to the races as winds kick in out of the southwest by three o'clock in the afternoon we could hit 70 degrees in Austin but don't get used to it. I did mention a cold front on the way. Look at the change. Calling it roller coaster temperatures. Our normal high is 63. We'll be well above that on Tuesday. Then Tuesday night, a cold front comes through. Shifting our winds to the north, it's going to be windy on Wednesday. High temperature just 50 degrees, but really feeling more like 40s through the day. Then early Thursday, there's not much moisture probably less than a hundredth of an inch, but as we've seen time and again, it doesn't take much moisture to cause icing. So 38 degrees your afternoon high, and in the morning, it could be in the 20s. That's our first potential for seeing a little bit of early freezing drizzle, maybe some ice, maybe some sleet. But then Thursday night into Friday, temperatures yet again drop below freezing down to 30. So I have on Friday morning, about a 20% chance of some ice, maybe some morning freezing drizzle with a question mark because it's certainly not a sure thing. Then Saturday, temperature around 35 degrees in the morning, just warm enough to keep us out of that ice zone. Cold rain in the morning, then another cold front coming through. It's pretty much a long shot, but I can't rule out maybe early Sunday about a 10% chance of some morning mix before things dry out. But as for warmth, if you like it warm, Tuesday is your best shot. So I've said it once, I'll say it again. Everything and the kitchen sink in the next seven days. Thanks as always for checking out Chicks Chats. Have a good night.